will begin in the district tonight with the destructive car accident in southeast. Look at that. It sent six people to the hospital. This happened at 16th and V streets, not far from Good Hope Road in the Ketchum Rec Center. Our Jess Arnold, she spent some time there this evening talking to neighbors about what needs to change. And next thing is, bow! And I was like, oh my God. Two cars slammed into each other and a pedestrian at the intersection of 16th Street and V Street Southeast just before 3 p.m. Sunday. The impact caused this white Chevy filled with four passengers to roll over. So we all ran down and my good friend Reggie, he flipped the car, him and a couple of other people because it was belly up and he had two children. One male was on the sidewalk and the children was upset. And the young lady that was in a passenger seat had to be opened up with the life of Jaws. D.C. fire officials said the two children and the woman in the front seat were taken to the hospital and they're expected to be okay. They said the male driver of the white Chevy, however, is in the hospital in critical condition. The pedestrian caught in the collision is also critical, while a man in the silver Chevy is dealing with less serious injuries. It's scary. I don't know how I'm asleep tonight. While D.C. police have yet to confirm any details about what happened, looking at the scene, you can see the silver car had a stop sign, while the white one did not. A nearby neighbor who asked not to be identified said that's the problem. I think there should be a four-way stop here because we have children, and this is horrible. And I cross the street all the time. They're speeding. I don't want to be a victim. I think they should also, like, put up lights, like red and green lights, so that so people could be more safer around here. Indira Shao, who had to watch this horrific aftermath, has an even simpler solution. Be mindful of what you do and how you go about your daily living. In Washington, Jess Arnold, WUSA 9.